Interesting email of um, one of our listeners uh, in Northamptonshire. His name's Peter. Lives in Corby in Northamptonshire. He said he's been. Uh, he was listening to my rant cast. Started putting all my rants together so you can download them off iTunes. You know. Anyway, he was having a listen and uh, he was trying to tune in. I think yesterday, but I wasn't on. Um, but he said um, he's going to be tuning in today. Anyway, basically, what he's done is he sent me this. Um, email because he's had an idea. You know, Brookside Close is up for sale. Yeah? Someone's going to get a bargain there because it's 13 houses, the one about half a million pounds. Well, I've had a, I've had a word with my bank manager seriously, seriously considering taking out a loan because I've been on good authority that uh, Brookside's coming back, you know. So somebody was telling me and they said, you know, they've heard it from the horse's mouth. Anyway, listen to what he suggests, Peter, Peter Kennedy's name is. He said, I want to tell you that I've been doing uh, what I've been doing with Brookside and see if I can interest you or your listeners. He says, it all started when I saw the pictures of the state of the coast in the paper. Do you see it? They looked awful, didn't they? All run down and overgrown. He said, I was quite saddened to see them. Doing some research, it dawned on me that this is a real street with its own postcode. Clearly, it's in a bit of a mess at the moment, and I gathered the owners want to auction it again on the 17th of December. As they're selling the houses as an entire lot, he says, I'm concerned that it will be bulldozed and another part of Liverpool's history is gone forever. Anyway, Peter goes on, he says, last week I wrote to English Heritage to see if they would be interested in preserving the buildings. He says, I've also been working with some fans on the Brookside Soapbox website. He says, I also have a Facebook group called Friends of Brookside Close and there's quite a following online. He says, I've never been to the coast myself, but I'd like to go. If it's demolished, that won't happen. I'd like to see these nice houses kept in a time when they're building houses left, right, and centre in the middle of a credit crunch. He says, it just doesn't add up. Anyway, he says, please, please put the idea to your listeners and contact me if you'd like any more information. And I'll let you know what English heritage you've got to say. You never know. You never know. They might buy them. Anyway, you've heard it first, exclusive on City Talk, 105.9, Brookside is on its way back. That's the rumour I've heard. Lots more to come.